for me, S is kind of the oldest and the newest part of ESG. Um, I was reminded yesterday by Amanda Young from Aberdeen that, that the East India Company, when they went out for their joint stock, um, were, ran into some trouble because of um, accusations of them still having slavery um, in their supply chains. Um, you go back to Dodge versus Ford in the 1920s, and Henry Ford wanted to invest in his workforce and improve conditions, and the Dodge brothers thought that that was their shareholder money, and they would, they would have that. Thank you very much. Um, UN Declaration of Human Rights in, in 1948. Um, but then this noisy little brother came along called, called E and, and started kind of getting all the attention. And I think certainly this century, um, a huge amount of the focus has been on, on climate and carbon, um, and quite right too. And especially um, since um, the COP21 in Paris in, in 2015, that has felt like um, it's kind of getting most, uh, most of the attention. Um, but that's not to say that, that things like human rights, worker well-being, diversity, equity, inclusion, um, and for banks, things like supporting small businesses and financial capability haven't always been there and always been really important parts of, of what we think about. They've just been maybe sitting slightly more in the background. Um, and um, as looking, looking forward and as things emerge, you've got sort of new, new developments such as ethics in AI and machine learning, um, the emergence of the gig economy and what that means and things like crypto assets and, and the metaverse and the ethical questions that all of those throw up um, that you have to apply some of that same that same thinking so f for, for me and I think for us at the bank S is incredibly multifaceted um, it's it's lots and lots of different topics kind of bunged into into one um, area and very often there's no one right answer and it requires a lot of stakeholder engagement and consideration um, before you kind of make a decision and move forward. <laughs>